Happy day, friends. It's a chill day here, thank goodness. Austin and I went out on a date, our first date without Micah since she's been born. First date day without the baby. And guess what the first thing we did was? <laughs> Buy diapers at Target. This is our life. Now that Micah's not with us, the world is our oyster. And I'm tired. <laughs> It's 7.40. Feels like 10. <laughs> I'm back! Jess is back. My beautiful wife. Did you miss me? I did. It's been good reconnecting. <laughs> oh, it won't let me record while we're... I was gonna spit out some mad lyric at, lyrics at you guys. <laughs> Woo! It really, really ain't my mother bleeping fault, man. <laughs> and we were out a little bit later than I expected we would be, and we didn't get to bed till a lot later than I expected we would. So I'm glad we just don't really have too much going on today. Just a chill day at home. Austin's been watching the game. I've been getting stuff done in my room. I've been really motivated to clear out my closet lately. I'll tell you guys a little bit more about that soon but I wanted to show you Micah real quick. Look how sweet she's being right now. This is pretty much how she's been all morning. She's been quiet, not huh, still. How she used to be. Yeah, this is like how she used to be for a long time. I don't know what it was. She may have been having another growth spurt, but the past few days she was really, really pretty fussy. I don't know if it's colic or if she's just having tummy issues or what it could be. Like I said, maybe a growth spurt, but she was getting really fussy. But the past like day and a half, she's been pretty much like that. And she's been so cuddly and that's what we love so much is just cuddling her. Like who doesn't love cuddling their newborn baby? Fingers crossed, um, it stays like this for a while and it's just smooth sailing from here. Our kitchen is a mess again. <laughs> I feel like all I'm showing you guys lately is a messy kitchen. But reason being is I just cleared out the fridge and the freezer because my milk storage is starting to stack up. I mean, I've got this whole shelf full. And to be completely honest, I don't know if that's a lot or not. Um, somebody was telling me like, wow, like that's really good. That's more than I had up to six months. And another person was telling me like they had way more than that. So every mom's different, obviously. But um, I feel like I'm at a good spot with my milk production. I feel like whatever I've been doing has been working. Oh, and now she's getting a little fussy. Are you getting hungry, girly? I think she's getting hungry. It's been, it's been a few hours. Normally she eats a lot sooner than, than that. I think I jinxed it. Just a little bit. She's been a little bit fussy. But I think she's just trying to poop. I think that's what it is. So as far as my closet situation, you guys, welcome to my closet. It's not often that I show it to you because I'm not super into fashion and clothes. However, now that I'm a mom, I feel like I need to step up my wardrobe game a little bit. I just, it's not that I need to, but I want to feel more put together. And the best way I know how to do that is by having like a good wardrobe and wearing something nice and that looks good almost every day. I mean, I'm not, I'm not, not every day, let's not push it. I do work from home. If you're ever on Pinterest, there's a good chance you've seen anything about what's called a capsule wardrobe. It's a very simple, clean, limited wardrobe and I feel like it would be so great for me because number one, it simplifies getting dressed in the morning. Almost everything that you have essentially will go together. I also love it because it's super neutral, like there's whites, blacks, grays, and very little color. And so far, I've kind of went through my clothes and from here, to about here. That's what I plan on keeping. There's a few things in here that I'll probably have to like get new things of or I don't know, just trade out. They're staple pieces, so I don't mind spending a little bit more on higher quality items when I know that they're staple pieces that I can wear for such a long time. All of these clothes over here are things that I probably won't wear much of at all. As you can tell, there's a little bit more color in there and the clothes that I'm getting rid of 
are all so colorful. I just love neutrals. Look at my room, look at my whole house. It's white and simple and I just love it. When Austin and I were out on our date last night, we, we finished off, we started and finished off our date at Target and I found um, just a plain whitish cream colored cami for like two bucks on the clearance rack. We didn't vlog because we wanted it to just be the two of us. I know that vlogging, there's nobody else there, but it almost in a way feels like you're bringing a bunch of people along. So we just, we kept it just us. We did include things on his Instagram though. And my workout clothes drawer, also lots of neutrals. Our really good friends are here, but the, her best friend just showed up. <laughs> Our bow is here. all over. Is it all over? Oh, oh, it was so good. Now we meet our daughter. Just get oh. rid of me. Oh, don't cry. Don't cry. Oh, oh my oh, goodness. Look at Ava. 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 You're like three pounds. <laughs> oh, you're okay. Oh, um, and now she's being don't, fussy. Don't. She was not fussy all no, day. She did so good. Ava, you, you, hey, you, you look so confused. Hi, Wookie. Hi. <laughs> this meeting has been needing to happen for weeks and weeks and weeks. And it's finally happening. Almost too much. Too Sorry, long. we live in an RV. Too you long. guys are awesome. Don't you worry about it. Oh my gosh. She's like, oh my gosh, why is mom holding another baby? It's okay. It's okay. You're fine. Aww. I love you so much. But look at your friend, Micah. You guys are going to go on adventures together and hikes and go rock climbing. It's going to be so fun. Aw, oh my gosh, so cute. Mike is all for it, huh? She's like, I guess. No, she's like, oh, dad's here. Okay, we're cool. Yeah, we're good, huh? This is Austin, Evelyn. We've met. You've met him. Yeah, we've met. You've met Jess, too. Yeah, we've got my hands. Is that a bird or a plane? No, it's Mikey. Oh, my God. Landing. Landing. Landing time. And it's time for you to ride in your Batmobile. Don't oh ask me why God. I sang Indiana Jones while you were Superman with a Batmobile. But that's how we roll in this house. Let's go on a walk. You don't know any different, huh? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Yesterday we spent some much needed quality time with the Jurgies. We hadn't seen them in so long. And I honestly forgot how much... I really missed them. So that was so nice. Today, Austin and I are gonna take a walk with Micah. We're gonna spend some quality time as a family because Austin's leaving me later this week. Uh, so we're trying to get in some good family time while he's gone. Um, he keeps saying like every day, he's like, I'm gonna miss you guys so much. I'm gonna miss you. And it's really, really sweet. And it makes me kind of sad to think about, but, but that's why we're spending some good time today together. Oh my gosh. Can you breathe in there? Of course you can. <laughs> You're gonna get all bundled up so we can go on a walk. She's all ready. It's been a little bit chilly outside, so hence we're bundling her up real good. Yeah, it's been like uh, 50s, it's, like 50s. it's been like 50s. Yeah, definitely need a yeah. jacket today. Well, the walk was successful, but the aftermath not so much. <laughs> She was being so good and cuddly yesterday and today. And then like tonight, she's just, I don't know. I don't know what it is. I'm still trying to figure out this whole baby thing. Yeah, she's been ultra feisty just this last hour. Yeah, this last hour she's been way feisty. She, it seems like she only wants to be held by me. Yeah. Which I love, but I don't love at the same time, so. I don't know. I'm a little bit nervous for when Austin has to leave if she doesn't kind of ease up a bit. Yeah. I'm gonna have a rough few days if that's Poor the case, dearly. but that's okay. We'll we'll make it work. It's a little bit rough for me too because I want to hold her and I want to cuddle her. And this morning she was ultra cuddly. We cuddled for at least an hour and it was wonderful. But when she's feisty like this and I want to help and I can't and I sometimes just make things worse just by being there, it's a little like disheartening in a way. Does it so. hurt your feelings? No, it doesn't hurt my feelings. I just, it makes me not feel good. Yeah. We're going to continue our family time and hopefully it's her bedtime. I know she's just tired, but she's like not going to sleep. So 
We're gonna try to put her to bed and just enjoy the night as a couple, hopefully. <laughs> yeah, let's do that. We have a lot of things coming up. Uh, Jess officially ordered all of our Halloween costumes, so they're gonna be here soon. Uh, we've got Micah's two month update, or appointment, appointment update. Appointment, yeah. I'm, so. I'm excited to see how much weight she's gained. She's obviously put on some weight. She's got some cheeks and some thighs now, so I'm excited to see <laughs> exactly how much weight she's gained. Yeah. So, anyway, we got a lot of good stuff coming up. Stay tuned, and we'll see you next time. Night, friends! Good night, everyone.